All right, guys. Uh, it's time for a German boss fight. Let's. Uh, Get all the umbilical cords to get the true ending. I'm not really sure if I'll be going for the other endings just to get the platinum. But first, we need to defeat this boss. I heard this boss is a kind of tough. So. Why didn't you show me earlier? You will die, forget the dream, and awake under the morning sun. You will be freed mm -hmm. from this terrible hunter's dream. I'm sorry, I can't accept that. Dear, oh dear, what was it? <laughs> The horrible dream. Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> he just backstabbed a lot. It always comes down to the hunter's helper to clean up after these sorts of messes. That's a nice weapon. You got that? Tonight, Gammon joins the hunt. All right. Whoa, nice move. Select a specific room that I had. Fuck. I'm an idiot. running out of what's he doing huh what okay I was not uh show what that attack was he just one shot me there uh, yeah uh, let me uh, change my rune first uh, we don't want this definitely we want the uh,
Yeah, we need this one definitely. Uh, I don't know if I need more of HP. Uh, which one should I go with? Rally potential seems to be good. Should I go with all damage reduction? Oh yeah, we still attack plus 20. Yeah, that should do it. And this I think will take uh, not radiance. Uh, that should be of uh, some help. Maybe. What's that attack? How far is that attack? Whoa, what? Not again. Oh shit. If you cheese that thing.
But do I need to kill both boss and as well as this demon together? Or... Because I don't have much blood oils or anything. I'll be able to finish. What? My god, the bold paper damage was awesome. Hmm, all right, done. Are you cold? Oh my god, so we are finally done with this game. <sighs> I mean, yeah. It did give us a lot of tough, tough time. But we did it at the end. I didn't do your yeah, chalice ones, but I wasn't feeling like doing those things because they didn't add anything much apart from a few bosses maybe. And one of the bosses, probably the most unique one, is uh, I mean, Tumerian uh, Princess Queen. Yeah, so this game, I mean, to take into consideration that this game came back in what 2015 2016, it is uh, it, 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 it has to be compared to you know those games that released back then and I believe it, it does have a really good uh, experience 
I mean definitely if you are new to Souls game this game should definitely be played once it does have a little bit of uh, you know uh, cons too so if I were to specify a few cons that I was not Good. much into all signed and sealed now let's begin the transfusion oh don't you worry whatever happens you may think it all a mere Yeah, so I was saying, um, yeah, it does, this game is really good. I mean, yeah, it's really good. I, uh, it has a really good uh, uh, gaming, as as in the. It is it is quite different from the other game, in terms of gameplay wise. And it it kind of trains you for that immediate. Dodge attack or. Uh, uh, you know getting the parries so you will be trained with that trigger movement that's kind of sounds weird but <laughs> and the bosses are great in this game they are they are the highlight of this game in each and every boss few are definitely frustrating especially the DLC bosses but it's either they are OP or you need to level up so if someone has to out level the other guy so if the boss is out level then you have to level your level up yourself that's the only way to do it so i completed uh what's his name orphan of cause then i killed the uh, first lawrence then i defeated i believe was any boss yeah i think after that we just killed game one so i killed all three bosses in a single day that's because I had leveled up so much. You can see my health bar right there. I leveled up so much that uh, the only thing that I needed was to defeat often, of course. And after that, everything was not that hard. Even Lawrence, I was thinking maybe he's a little tough, but we just had to uh, understand his movements and it's fine. So the only three bosses that I had issues with was probably the first boss of the souls game ever that I had played and which is um, Father Gascoigne then the next that I had an issue with was uh, then it started to the DLC with the uh, uh, what's her name Lady Marie I, I, I had an issue with Lady Marie I mean she she just destroyed me and after that maybe often of course so these three bosses are the only ones that I had difficulty with all the other bosses are like smooth. German might have been hard, but I think I just over leveled him. Oh, pardon. Uh, regarding the cons, I'd say <coughs> I would have really loved that if this game had a, a refill option that every time you die, you get your items back, but you have to farm each and every time, which kind of takes you out of the experience out of this game. Because it's a really good game and you don't want anything kind of forced. I mean, if it wasn't too much, then it wouldn't have been a much bigger problem. But it's like too much. You have, I think I might have farmed for bosses maybe 10 to 15 times. Maybe. Or maybe more than that. Maybe less than 20. Definitely less than 20. But farming each and every time in the different areas was really uh, kind of getting me out of the whole game. And the pros are it has a really good gameplay mechanic, it has a really good atmosphere. Like all the enemies are just various, it definitely gets you into that horror kind of vibe here. You definitely will find chills because <laughs> few areas with that that music, like even now I don't know if it, it sounds a little faint, I don't know if you guys will be able to hear it, but there's a child's cry. Uh, I did manage to read the lore about this game, about all the DLC as well. It's kind of, it's really great. Uh, I believe I do have uh, two more, regarding the achievements, I have two more that I need to get. Uh, one is the all weapons and, uh, oh, two, no, I mean three. So, one would be all weapons and the other two would be getting the, 
two different endings which is easier than the one that I did right now so the first one was you just quit you just say I, I accept and he just kills you the second one is you fight German and the uh, the last beast he turns you into uh, his slave and you will be doing what German used to do because German is dead and now the uh, the, the beast, what was it called? I am not able to recollect what it's called. The great one, he would want you to do its bidding. So you would take German's place. So those two endings. So basically these three are the things, achievements that if I get, I'll get platinum. But because I'm not much into getting the platinum and I've already seen the endings, I don't think I'll be getting them any sooner. Um... I mean, if you are definite, if you are new to Souls game and you are wondering which one to get, I would definitely recommend this one because even the graphics are doesn't look that outdated when you compare this to Dark Souls one or two. So Dark Souls three came out of, came after the Bloodborne. So I think the graphics would be better. But if you want a new experience with you know, no, uh, you haven't missed any series before this. So Bloodborne is the one and only series. So you should definitely go with Bloodborne if you are thinking whether you should or you should not. You should definitely go with Bloodborne. If those two cons aren't an issue with you. So if I had to give this game and everything, I would give it an, a 7.5 or 8, maybe 8 out of 10. Two points for those farming and uh, uh, the narration. There is no narration in this game. You just have to read all the item description and everything. So yeah. And if you like this series, you liked uh, what I'm doing here, please make sure to hit that like button and definitely subscribe to my channel. I'll be uploading new videos every day, Monday to Friday. And you can catch me live with Twitch. The link is down in the description below. So make sure to catch you uh, follow me in Twitch as well. I'll be live Saturday, Sunday, every day in Twitch. So thank you for being here and uh, if you have if you didn't like anything make sure you you can hit that dislike button and let me know down in the comments below what you didn't like about this series or this video specifically and uh, that would help me to that would definitely help me to you know uh, get better with the next uploads which will be coming so yeah thank you guys and i'll see you guys in the next video